just me again. Your 3.30's here. So we're in. Mm -hmm. Detective Sarah Cordell. Yes, I know. This is General Carmine Walcott. You will refer to her as ma'am or General Walcott. I'm Colonel Anand. How should I address you? You don't. I'll take your gun now, Detective. Is that really necessary? I must insist. Detective, you can carry that gun wherever you like. Just not in this space and not during this interview. I won't ask again. You'll get this back when this is over. Wow. Assuming things go favorably. Access denied. Access denied. Oh, Access, no. Access denied. Oh, this stupid thing is useless. Let me. You are applying for? Major, with the Compliance Regarding Applicant Hiring Procedures Division, ma'am. Right. With crap. It's my division. Yes, ma'am. You are familiar with the Fair and Equitable Hiring, Hiring Practices, Practices Act. Act of 2062. Yes, ma'am. It mandates that there must be a balance within organizations regarding very specific employee criteria. Further, it outlines the percentage of employees within the company that must have each attribute. Non-compliance... It's punishable by death, detective. Adherence to this rule is CRAP's priority number one, and it will be your job to police it without mercy. I assume you're comfortable with that? Yes, ma'am. It's fixed. Hmm. Can you do stop visiting that website? Okay, let's see. You graduated from MIT summa cum laude. I spent five years with the military, then 10 years with the Westernville Police Department. During that time, I- Stop. Detective, I don't need to know, nor do I care what you've done in the past. My only job during this segment of the interview process is to make sure that you meet the specific hiring criteria for this role. In this department, doing what we do, we need to be above reproach. Yes, ma'am. I've read the job description, and I'm aware of the specific criteria required for this position. I'm fully qualified. We'll see about that. Take a seat. Place your hand on this and answer my questions as quickly and completely as possible. Access denied. Access denied. Access denied. Really? Access granted. <laughs> You were born in August. Yes, August 1st, 2021. You are a Leo. Yes, with an Aquarius rising. What is your gender? I identify as female. Are you married? Yes, married to the job. <laughs> no, ma'am, not married. What is your shoe size? Seven, seven and a half. It varies depending on the make. Do you require the use of orthopedic aids? No. Do you require the use of visual aids? Yes, I've needed contacts or glasses since I was 17. What is your eye color? Most days dark brown. Depending on the light, it can appear lighter or darker. 
What is your blood type? AB positive. Are you ambidextrous? Yes, but right hand dominant. Candidate approved. <laughs> Congratulations, detective. You've met all the requirements for the role. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. I'm ready to start as soon as possible. Detective Cordell. Flattered as I am, detective. Fraternization within this department is uh, frowned upon. That type of behavior will end your employment before it begins. It's nothing like that, ma'am. There's something in my contacts. Then put on your glasses. You still meet the visual aids criteria. The sunglasses, detective. Now. Stand up, detective. Slowly. And keep your hands where I can see them. You have committed a very serious crime, Detective Cordell. The job posting clearly stated brown eyes. Actual, natural, brown eyes. There will be repercussions. Fuck! You were saying something about a serious crime and repercussions, Carmine? Welcome to crap, Major Cordell. The Colonel will drop your papers and you can start on Monday. You'll wear the contacts at all times, and uh, we'll, we'll never... never speak of this again, ma'am. Now, about my gun. Thank you.